Hello everyone, I am Sneashish and in this video we are going to talk about investing money on your blog in the very first year. See, the first year of our website are very important because in this year we create the base of our website and learn many new things. So it is important to know correctly that where to invest money for our blogs so that it returns we get some value or growth of our website see i am not an expert or a pro blogger so i am not going to guide you or giving you any pro tips of blogging so what i am gonna do i will just share my experiences with you and i will tell you about the mistakes that i did in my first year of blogging career so let's start The first thing is thinking about traffic. See, majority of the beginners thinks how to grow more traffic and many of them search on Google or YouTube and see many videos on it and many of them use traffic bot to grow the traffic to their website now what is traffic bot there are many kinds of websites there are many kinds of website which provides you uh, a traffic bot or a bot traffic which will increase the statistics in your blogger dashboard and you will find that uh, somebody see your blog but that's not true it is totally a fake viewer which is uh, not a real viewer it is just a bot traffic so there are some websites which send you bot traffic which are not real uh, to your website now many of you can ask that what is the big deal on that actually the thing is we need to understand how the whole thing works see I believe in one thing that is success is not defined by the viewers of your blog it is defined by the number of satisfied viewer in your blog means maybe you have got only 50 viewers per day okay in that 50 viewers let's say there are minimum 20 viewers who are fully satisfied by your content that means these 20 viewers are kind of your permanent viewers that means there are more chance that they will come back to your blog and read your new post again so that's how uh, traffic increasing or uh, growth of your blog's traffic works so stop thinking about your blog traffic the only way to increase the traffic of your blog is to write quality contents if you write good contents then viewers will see your blogs and also your blog get ranked on google or bing or other search engines mainly in google okay so now second thing is stop wasting money to make ads of your website not in your website of your website now uh, i made this mistake one time once i create a facebook ad a uh, facebook ad campaign which uh, took me around 5000 oh, sorry 500 rupees uh, around but after that i understood that uh, how this all works and uh, i come back from that idea now let us say you create a campaign which uh, on uh, either facebook ads or google ads for uh, 2000 rupees okay now it will give you let's say 3000 viewers per day but 
in this 3000 view per day there are only uh, 10 to 5 percent of 5 to 10 percent viewers will click those ads that means these uh, 3000 views are the viewers of your ads not the clickers of your ad that means they 90% uh, of them will not click uh, your ad and view the main content only 5 or 10 percent people are there who will click and uh, uh, read your main contents and uh, in this 5 to 10 percent there are only 2 to 3 percent viewers will be there who will take the ad or your content seriously and uh, will read the whole contents and give you some return value or some income. So the thing is it is in the end of the day uh, you can earn near about 20 rupees let us say or 50 rupees or maybe it will uh, increase to 100 rupees but the thing is you give 2000 rupees and you get 100 rupees which is definitely not worth it so stop making ads for your website now next is stop sharing your content with your family members and your friends continuously so it is uh, sounds very rude uh, that but if it is fact that uh, if you share your content with your friends or your family members friends or family members then they will uh, not in the majority case uh, they will not see your article or definitely not read your article so uh, the whole thing will be like similar as a uh, bot traffic which is again not worth it so these are the mistakes uh, that many beginners do now let's talk about what are the things you have to follow right you have to follow or uh, where to invest now the first thing is write creative contents uh, if you are uh, getting any noise from my end then very sorry for that uh, now coming to our point that is write creative contents okay now a creative content means a content where you provide information in very easy way with point to point discussion it will help you to get viewers as well as your post get ranked on Google. If you write creative contents, the viewers will come back to see your post again. So writing creative contents should be your first priority. Okay, this should be your first priority in the first year, not in the first year, but your whole blogging career. Now the next thing is purchasing domain. Now this is not a, a compulsory thing. If you want to invest your money in your blog in the first year of your blogging career, then you can uh, try to invest uh, by purchasing domain. Obviously the best domain um, for your blog though it is not necessary uh, to buy a domain but you can try or you can buy it if you want in my opinion the biggest investment in uh, blogging is time okay nothing is bigger than time if you invest time in uh, your blogging or your blogs you will definitely get a better result from it and the more you invest time and uh, you uh, figure out the things and you work more hard in uh, your blogs in your post in writing posts in creating pages in uh, creating new things in your uh, in your blogs changes new things then you will uh, get a better result okay 
now let's our uh, third point is customize customize your website now as we all know that blogger provides us very few templates or themes but wordpress and other platforms like wix.com gives us too many options and there are too many plugins and too many themes uh, you can install them you can uh, purchase them or many things so uh, you can customize your website by uh, uh, installing them if you are in wordpress or in wix.com and uh, by downloading free templates uh, for from other websites if you are in blogger now if you are in uh, blogger.com then here is my tip that uh, you are in google blogger then don't buy templates in the very first year there are lots of websites which will sell you uh, many uh, premium themes many uh, good looking themes uh, but don't buy them at least in the first year because in the first year you are uh, a learner you will learn many things many new things and after learning all the things uh, you can uh, find that you can find that that template which you have buy that is not good for your website that you find uh, you will find something which is better for your website so if you buy a template in the beginning then you will regret for it so these are the things you should follow in the starting of uh, starting year of your blogging career uh, so that's it hope you like this video if you find any value from this video then give us a thumbs up and press the subscribe button and also uh, share this with your friends and um, if you want to check my website then you can check it from the description the link is given in the description box and if you think that i should add something more then also comment in the comment section it will be glad for me to know your answers if you want to add me something then please comment below